Hello everyone, welcome to this new video and today I'm going to teach you how to do um, isometric drawing like this that you're seeing here on the screen. So, this video is pre-recorded and I'm just translating it from Spanish to English. So, I'm going to be like kind of telling you what's going on. So, the first thing that we have to do is we have to go to view on top where you, right there we click on view and then we go to show okay okay show grid right so we can see the grid on the screen so once we have this going on we're gonna use the first of all we have to understand how the perspective works right so for this tutorial i'm going to be using like a perspective isometric perspective obviously but i'm going to do like three like three squares and three squares to the right and one up or three squares to the left and one up depending on the situation so we're going to be using the lasso tool as you can see there you can see the one that i'm using if you don't see it just hold the click there and you're gonna see the, the tool so we're gonna start doing the the thing right as I say three to the light three to the right one up we can do it again and there we have the first kind of like part of our drawing right there right so we fill it in with color to do the shades and then we go ahead and do the other part <clears throat> this is just like a pretty simple example of what you can do you know it's just like a little square well not a square it's like a little rectangle or whatever in 3d so yeah pretty much this is like the the basic gist of how to do it from here i'm just gonna continue and do a bunch of examples that you can see i'm gonna try to like make it faster so i'm gonna put it in a speed art and there for that example there you can see like the final result without the grid so this is how it would look actually without the grid as i said and as you can see it looks really professional like 3d and stuff and very cool all right so now I mean, I just like, yeah, I'm just doing examples of like things you could do. For example, this, you can make it bigger that way. Well, so this is like another example that I did. I was like, this is a little bit more complicated. And as you can see, it looks kind of ugly because I did it wrong. <laughs> like the perspective is not very good there on the right. As you can see, it's kind of, you know, it looks, it's not aligned with the, the actual perspective that it should have. But as you can see, it's, with practice, you're going to get it right. This is just like a little mistake that I made. And obviously, as it gets more complicated, then it's much harder to like keep up with the perspectives and all that stuff but as i say just like practice and it's really not that complicated it's really simple so uh thank you a lot for watching i hope this was helpful now after this i'm gonna leave you with another kind of like speed art of another example that i did so i hope you enjoy it and yeah see you in the next videos bye